That's nice. Let's go, dude. Oh, okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, you really came. Sorry, I wasn't expecting that. It's not much, but make yourself at home. Oh, are you hungry? I can get you something to eat. This is a ghost sandwich. Do you want to try it? You phrased right through it. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, dude, you're so depressing. <laughs> After a gate meal, I like to lie on the ground and feel like garbage. It's a family tradition. Do you want to join me? Okay, follow my lead. Here we go. You'll lie down as long as you don't move. So only move around when you want to get up, I guess. Well, that was nice. Thank you. Uh, I'm gonna keep working on that mix CD. Oh, that's my TV. There's a show I like to watch on it sometimes. Ha, <laughs> huh, that's nice. He's a music maker. Uh, I'm gonna keep working on that mix CD. This CD is labeled Goldie Day Music. Play it. Hell yeah, dude. That was great, dude. It's locked. Okay, I can't. It's a snail, for some reason. You can't help but wonder what it tastes like. Toriel! Snail, snail, a long journey extends in front of you. Snail, snail, reach far and stretch beyond the horizons. Snail, snail, so snail of Sambiol. I've been long overdue for a second house. This snail is counting dollar bills. Damn, that snail rich as fuck. Do you want to play a game? It's called Thunder Snail. The snails will race, and if the yellow snail wins, you win. It's ten gold to play. Okay, press C repeatedly to get an order your snail. Ready? Three, two, one. Rush, little bastard! Rush, you little fucker! Ah, uh, my snail caught on fire. <laughs> oh, looks like you carved your snail too much. Really got to her. Oh, oh man, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I was too over my snail. Awkward. I'm working right now. I mean, welcome to Blook Family Snail Farm. Yeah, I'm the only employee. This place used to get a lot of business, but our main customer disappeared one day. Now it's just some hairy guy that shows up once a month. <laughs> just some big hairy dude. Blook Ica's Hotland Temi Village. What the fuck? Hold up. I want to know what this Temi Village is. What's going on, man? Yeah, I'll take two of those, man. I've been around a long time, maybe too long. Studying history sure is easy when you've lived through so much of it yourself. <laughs> oh, hold on. King Fluffy Buns. He's a friendly, happy-go-lucky kind of guy. If you keep walking around long enough, you'll probably meet him. He loves to walk around and talk to people. Eh, what do I call Dreamer Fluffy Buns? Oh, that's a great story. I remember it. But if you come back, I'm sure I'll have remembered by then. Eh? You don't know what it is? What are they teaching you kids at school nowadays? <sighs> That's the Delta Rune. Ah. <laughs> the emblem of our... No uh, That's why Rasse looks like Ezra. <laughs> uh, I get it. I'm not just, I wasn't even fucking reading it. Um, it says, uh, says oh, King Flavi Bounds can't name for beans. Undyne? Yeah, she's the local hero around here. Though grit and determination alone, she fought her way to the top of the royal guard. Actually, she just came through here asking about someone who looked just like you. I'd watch your back, kid, and buy some items. You might just shave your hide. That emblem actually predates written history. The original meaning has been lost to time. All we know is that the triangle symbolizes us monsters below, and the winged door circle above symbolizes something else. Most people say it's the angel from the prophecy. 
Oh, yeah, the prophecy. Legend has it, an angel who has seen the surface would descend from above and bring us freedom. Lately, the people have been talking a bleaker outlook. Calling that wind circled the angel of death, a harbinger of destruction waiting to free us from this mortal realm. In my opinion, when I see that little circle, I just think it looks neat. Haha. <laughs> That's cool, man. Be careful out there. Get damn right, I'll be careful. Hurt, beaten, and fearful for our lives, we surrender to the humans. Seven of their greatest magicians sealed us on the ground with a magic spell. And if you can enter through the seal, but only beings with a powerful soul can leave. There is only one way to reverse this spell. If a huge power equivalent to seven human souls attacks the barrier, it will be destroyed. But this cursed place has no entrance or exits. There is only one. There is no way a human could come here. We will remain trapped down here forever. I mean, I just fell down a hole and ended up here, and Toriel was there. She found me. Oh, that's convenient. Little squeaky mushrooms. They lead the way of the victories. Squeaky mushrooms. What the fuck? Hold on. Uh -huh. I didn't agree to no squeak mushrooms. Ah, uh, do I have to go all around? Uh, I gotta go all around. Uh, is she alright? She's fucking vibrating. Feed Timmy Flakes. Timmy only wants the Timmy Flakes. No, so hungry. Oh. What the fuck? Calm down there, Jake the dog. What the fuck? Flex. You flex at Timmy. No, muscles are not cute. Oh, I have to disagree. No! Just the two of us. Oh, what the fuck, dude? Hold on, I didn't agree to this. I didn't agree to this, man. I just wanted to say hello to... You flex. Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. You want... What the fuck the hell did I just do? I just wanted to say hello to Tammy and, and, and fucking she's jittering like a fucking 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 pol I don't know, I don't know polio. I don't fucking know. Some disease, I'm sure it's something. Ah, uh, no, I could just go around. But Tammy wants ten flakes. I don't know how many ten flakes. Without candles or magic to guide them home, the monsters use crystals to navigate. Okay. Ah, oh, I see what's going on. I need to light up the path. Like Ebola. Is it Jimmy? You walk into mold smell. I'm gonna spare them. I don't wanna kill these bastards. Get out of here! Oh, you don't wanna get out of here. Right. Blood. You wiggle your hips suddenly. Oh my god. What the fuck? Holy shit, it grew. Um. Hug it. You hug mob, but of course slime covers you. Your speed decreased. Uh, what the fuck? I am simultaneously turned on and yet terrified. Lie down. You lie down. Mob lies down too. Mob understands life now. Ask me. I'm glad it understands its life. That's like really important to life. I I don't want any part of your shit though. Please go away. I'd rather not have to jab you in the mouth. Roar. Say say this is why you're starting to piss me off, buddy. You hug my bird gross long cuffs you, you speed decreases. What the fuck am I meant to do then? Do I unhug it? I wiggle my ass at it. You don't hug my back. It appreciates your respect out of its boundaries. Oh. It didn't like being hugged. Well, that's fair. I mean, yeah, that's, that's fair. That's that's fair. I wouldn't like to be hugged to by a random person. I mean, that just sucks. Being hugged just sucks. I can tell you that right now. I don't like. Human contact makes me scared. I'd like to just run into a safe spot. That'd be great, because I only plan to record for 30 minutes, like I promised my mate. And I, it's been fucking 28 minutes yet. Do you want me to fucking fight up? You want, uh, fucking throw, throw Undyne at me. And we'll see just how that goes.
I'm sure you're gonna do it. Behind you. Oh, what a fucking surprise. It's undone. <laughs> Hello, fish lady. Seven, seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dreamer, will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give it back to the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. How about you go fuck yourself, I'm not. Go on, then. Give me the jab. Oh. Antine, I'll help you. What? You little bitch. Yo, you did it. Antine is right in front of you. You've gotten front row seats to her fight. I am the fight. Wait, who's she fighting? <laughs> to the little bitch. <laughs> Why wouldn't he just run for it? I mean, it's the perfect time to just do a runner. Unless she's distracted, do it, just run. Oh, wait. The angel, the one who has seen the surface, they will return and the underground will go empty. Hold on, I just realized these things. Speak to me. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm. If I say my wish, you promise you won't laugh at me. Of course I won't laugh. Someday, I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under, standing under the sky, looking at the world all around. That's my wish. Hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. Sorry, it's just funny. That's my wish, too. Okay, best friends. <laughs> friendo and friendo. Best friends. Yo! Oh, didn't you just get fucking dragged? What's going on, dude? You gonna fucking give me a dick? Wait, what? <laughs> I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're human, right? <laughs> Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now. I mean, Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies for something. But I kind of stink at that. So, yo, say something mean so I can hate you, please. Nah. Yo, what? So I had to do it? Here goes nothing. Yo, I... I hate your guts. Man, I... I'm such a turd. Um, I'm gonna go home now. Bye, dude. Oh, no. Yo, wait, wait. Help. I tripped. Help the kid up. Yo, dude. If... If you you want to hurt my friend, you're gonna have to get through me first. <gasps> ah! Oh, uh, oh my God! Anton's backing off. He's done. She doesn't want any of that. She doesn't want any of that. Boom. She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. <laughs> we'll have just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I think my parents are worried sick about me. Get going, man. I'll be here later, dude. Doodles. Can I please get a side point, please? I want to stop recording. <laughs> okay, we're going into the big spooky cave then. All right. Let's go. Let's do it. Oh, fuck's sake. She's right there. Seven. Seven human souls and King Osgore will become a god. Six. That's how many you have collected thus far. Understand? For your seventh... And final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as is customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. Oh, fuck, Psycho. It all started long ago. No. You know what? Screw it! Oh, shit. <laughs> Why should I tell you that story when you're about to die? Fuck it, alright, calm down. <laughs> Jesus, woman. You! You're standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams. Alphys's history books made me think humans were compassionate, but you, you're just a remorseless criminal. You wander through the caverns, attacking anyone in your path. I barely fucking attacked anyone, woman. <laughs> Self-defense? Please. I'm pretty sure I spared most people. I'm pretty sure I've only killed, like, four. You didn't kill them because you had to. You killed them because it was easy for you. Because it was fun for you. 
Do you think it was fun when I found out? Shiren, who was just learning to sing, was dead because of the whims of the single human? No. But your time's up, villain. You won't hurt anyone else. A knight in shining armor has appeared. And all the pain you inflicted on the fallen, every hope, every dream you've turned to dust, she's gonna send right back through your spear. I'll show you how determined monsters truly are. Come on, step forward and it's let's end this. Ah, uh, fuck off, I'm not. Ah, oh, save point. Well, guess what? I can't stop it now because I'm the one who wants to fucking fight. I'm fucking in the fucking game here. I'm gonna fucking be a deep shit. That's it then. No more running away. Here I come. Alright, I'm done. Let's go. On guard. Plead. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face danger head on. You won't last a second against me. Is that what you mean? Not bad. Then how about this? I applied Jack and Dax to Sorry, you ain't got me. Undyne holds her fist in front of her and shakes her head. Four years we've dreamed of a happy ending. Well, fucking don't kill me and I'll... Ow. I fucked up. Undyne bounces impatiently. What the fuck is she, a five-year-old? Now Satellite is just within reach. You know what, I'm fucking gladly help you with that, but you gotta fucking not try and kill me. Please. Undyne flashes a menacing smile. You mean with her fucking yellow ass teeth? I won't let you snatch it away from us. Fucking worry if you just fucking piss off Undyne, Jesus Christ. Undyne points heroically towards the sky. Nyah! Enough warming up. And you got some flowy hair for a fish. Oh fucking dead. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, you turd. Flee? No. Mercy! Ha! I still can't believe you want to spare me. Well, I have mm, zero interest in her hurting you because mm, I just don't. You're a pretty cool character, I guess. You won't fuck off, though. I have no items. Great. But even if I spared you. Okay, we're green again. Suplex is a. <laughs> Undone. Suplex is a huge boulder just because she can. Jesus fucking Christ. Calm down, Chris Redfield. God damn. No human has ever made it past Asgore. Uh, I'll just rub Asgore's little fluffy head. Oh my fucking god. Undyne bounces impatiently. Honestly, killing you now is an act of mercy. Undyne, you're a fucking bitch. Lady, what the fuck? Undyne. Undyne. Suplexing boulders now. A fate rests upon you. Vlad, stay determined. She just fucking killed me, dude. Alright. I got a feeling I can't do this without items, but I really don't want to go back. So, I'm just gonna have to try again. And God. I kinda know what I'm doing. I kinda know what I'm doing, so hopefully I can do it this time. Not bad, then how about this? I've faced with harder things before. For years we've dreamed of a happy ending, yes. I oh, know, just fucking let me fucking do the happy ending for you and you fucking get the happy ending, man. Just because she can. And now, son. <laughs> I just realized that's on bait. I got this. I got this, man. I fucking got hit by that again. I, <sighs> I still can't believe you want to spare me. Yeah, I don't really. What the hell is new? This is new. That's new. But even if I- uh, yeah, I, I saw this before. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, we're back to green. Undone towers threateningly. No human has ever made it past Asgore. Yes, well, I promise I'll try. Fuck it. 
It smells like sushi. Okay. <laughs> Good to know. Honestly, kill ah, oh, killing you is a mercy. Mmm. flips her spear impatiently. So stop being so damn resilient. I'm not really. I'm just really fucking... Just... Just really good at dodging, apparently. Undone flashes a menacing smile. What the hell are humans made out of? Skin, bone, muscles. Honestly, we're very squishy. I'm surprised. Like, one spear would probably kill us. Anyone else would be dead by now. Obviously, I'm not anyone else. I'm the main protagonist. <laughs> You've never faced someone as main protagonist. Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the ground with her fists. She is angry. Jeez, Alphas told me humans were determined. Did she now? You fucking sneaky little bitch. Undyne think. I see now that she meant by that. Ha! <laughs> Get me once. You fooled me. Get me twice. Go fuck yourself. But I'm determined too. Never mind then, Jesus Christ. Determined to end this right now. Yeah, so like I'm <laughs> Got real buzz. I need to get some healing items. Uh, I'm gonna go back, uh, get some healing items. Probably come back into another recording session later. Thank you all for watching. My name is Laddie Chris. Peace out. Godspeed, and see you all in the next session. Goodbye.